I've definitely set a, a new record today for a number of times I've been linked the same tweet. And trust me, I am not complaining. The previous records used to be, um, what you egg, he stabs him, the Shakespeare quote, or uh, the Shakespeare passage, I should say. And then, um, why don't bald men fight like this? And it's two dinosaurs hitting their heads together. And then also, is this a sandwich? And it's a bagel, but instead of being cut uh, laterally, it's being cut um, transversally. I don't know. I, I'm not good with three dimensions, but you, you get what I mean. Instead of, cu instead of cutting it into two O's, they cut it into two C's. You know what I mean? I can't rotate shapes in my head. I know! It's so stupid! Perpendicular to the long axis? Well, it's not vertically instead of horizontally, though. Because, like, there's three different ways to cut a bagel, but only two of them are meaningfully different because the bagel is a circle. You can cut it along the equator, you can cut it along the prime meridian, or you can cut it along the third axis, but the third axis is almost exactly the same. Anyway, like, it doesn't matter, because I've lost my uh, train of thought. The tweet that I've been linked to the most today was the Megan Fraser tweet, tweet, <laughs> tweet which was, um, so I'm paraphrasing because I don't have it up in front of me, but I can get it in three seconds because uh, it was linked to me a thousand times today, and I laughed every single time. Let me, just, uh, let me just find it here. I'm scrolling. There it is, one hour ago. Niles. Meet Megan, my new robot with artificial intelligence. Frazier replies, ah, artificial intelligence. So she also went to Yale. Really good tweet. Why do I have closed captioning? Okay, so I enabled closed captions. I think that my expectation is that they're not going to be perfect. It's, it's a plug-in in OBS, but hopefully, like, if... It's something that interests you. Let me put it this way. I don't think it would be like me turning on Netflix closed captionings and being mad that they're like slightly desynced. I think you should expect that like maybe one in eight words is going to be wrong or something like that. And maybe the timing will be a little messed up, but at least it's doing something. At least it's helping out. If you want to turn it off, there is a CC button on your video player. And if you click on that, then you're good. It's complete nonsense. I'm really, I'm trying to articulate as, as well as I could. I feel like I'm being very articulate. That one worked. I mean, just get ready, because as soon I'm gonna start yelling and then I'm gonna talk really loud and the words are gonna run together and it's, yeah, you get the idea. You're very loquacious. Loquacious is an old word, it means talkative. It got that one. I mean, the thing is loquacious. You'd think it would be a hard word, but I don't... Oh, no, it said luck wishes. All right, never mind. Anyway, listen, that's not what we're going to do today. We're not just going to be like, hey, the CC is off. What we're going to say instead is thank you for making an effort to at least be uh, more accessible. Although it's like maybe because it's coming up with the wrong words, it might actually be worse than nothing. But, you know, we'll... we'll it's an effort, let's put it that way. Is there, like, I, I'm looking at the settings, is there anything I can do here? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. It gave up. Well, I clicked on the settings button and OBS crashed. So I think I have to, like, control shift escape. And then, like, close OBS and reopen it. Hello? Hello? Can you still hear me? My OBS has just turned into, uh, like, a faded window with a, with a spinning blue circle. Okay, control shift escape. I'll, I'll be back in just a moment. When you hear this message, say hello. When you hear this message, type farfalle with no spelling mistakes. Okay, good. So I, I turned it off, but we'll do some troubleshooting. Because it, it crashing OBS while also getting 75% of the words wrong is probably like not the spirit of what we intended that to work like. But we'll, 
We'll keep a go we'll keep an eye on the GitHub project. So some streamers are doing it. So obviously there's something uh, there's something to it. The CC was pretty funny though. Well, yeah, it was. Uh, it, it, that's why I didn't like it that much because it was taking some of the the adoration away from me. It's not meant to be funny. It's meant. It's meant. It's not meant to have any like you know GPT three chat uh, AI learns how to tell a joke. It's it's meant to translate my jokes and then you laugh because it's a reference to something you're familiar with oh you're right i didn't tweet hold on i love not tweeting but we should tweet i'm live playing midnight suns by popular demand it's a joke it's very dry i have a i have a dry sense of humor i would say a lot of people don't like my sense of humor because I think because I tell it like it is. Like I was at dinner with my uh, with my family uh, over the holidays, and I said, "Hey, Dave, knock knock." He said, "Who's there?" I said, um, "Your son's birth parents." And they got so mad. My mother-in-law asked me to leave the dinner, and I was like, "I'm joking. Relax. Why are you hurting my feelings like this? This is a this is React Court. In case you weren't there yesterday." My Peloton is here! Apollo, let's go! There's dozens of us! Yo, and on that day, his uh, friends list on Peloton grew 33%. Let's go! There are dozens of us. Dozens of us. Yeah, I gotta put it together. Understandable. Understandable. Have a good day. After the IKEA stream, I'm with Apollo that I think it should be easier to put together uh, the Peloton. Because it's just like, it's just screws, probably. I don't know. Would love to know your thoughts on this. I guess an IKEA uh, piece of furniture is just screws as well, but like, you know. I don't know. I don't. I don't, I don't really. I don't have anything to say. I guess I passed my turn. I also told Apollo to make sure that he. Um, Where'd you learn that one? What the hell? He's frenzying himself. Uh, I told him to make sure that he uh, under tightens the flywheel so that he can get Lance Armstrong output, but not actually be working that hard. Like today, I, I guess I haven't given you my uh, my Peloton update today. There were no new 45 minute rides, so I did uh, a 30 minute ride. 382 kilojoule output, then a 15 minute ride that was like 170 something. So the average over 45 minutes would be around like a 550, then a 10 minute cool down. But on my 30 minute ride, I was uh, second place out of like 90 or something like that. The dude in front of me had like triple my output. He actually had like Floyd Landis output. So either this dude is in the Tour de France or he's, he juiced his own Peloton. You think it's uh, embarrassing for me to talk about like my real Peloton stats after taking the ride? Imagine how much more pathetic it is to juice your Peloton. You know, maybe he didn't do it on purpose. I'm just saying, my man's is he's hacking the leaderboard. How about it? Help me. I will help you, Wolverine. Yo, dude, he just hit the gritty. No, it is. So listen, I haven't watched 90 day fiance really in like two and a half years three years or something like that but um when i was younger quiet for a moment i did see a clip from the uh the tell all that they do at the end of every season where big ed the guy who's got a big head said he hadn't spoken to like his ex-girlfriend in years and then his ex-girlfriend appeared on the screen and showed text messages that were like you look beautiful can i come visit you in the philippines and big big ed's current girlfriend said ed what the hell do you have to say for yourself and he said me no speak english i do not know what it was he just for the record he is uh american <laughs> and all he speaks is english sleeping at the foot of my bed by the next night my man was, he's on like one of the most popular right. shows on, on international TV. All he could come up with in the moment was me no speak English. So it was just one of the wildest clips I've ever seen. Ed always asking me for uh, FaceTime. 
you want to uh, be joker with him to FaceTime. She says thanks. He says, I want to come to the Philippines again to see you if you're open. Caught red-handed, and of course, he can't take the heat. Did you or did you not just say, I have not spoken to her? Me no speak English. I think the host pressed him a little bit and he said, you see, this is what she's always like. And I'm like, what are you talking about? You got caught in a, you got caught in a lie. And you're like, whoa, she's mad? Of course she's mad. Oh! The portal stayed open this time. Yeah, almost feels too easy. Guess we go in and kick its ass. You ever think about how jacked Wolverine? Whoa, let's go! Dun 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 dun. You ever think about how jacked Wolverine has to be that you can see his eight pack through leather? Captain America, White Knight, and a diamond full face prop. Okay, one second. If you'll excuse me, I just want to go to customization. Okay, that looks sick, but I'm never giving you my real credit card number for this. Are you? That, both of these look, maybe I'm like actually unironically bad chesting. Both of those look amazing to me. If I saw this in the theater, I would be standing and applauding for sure. Okay, that looks absolutely god awful. Let's, let's run with that. It, it looks like there's like a texture error and it didn't load in. I will follow the bar guest into the Hunter, portal. Hold on just a moment. What is it, Doctor? I doubt that portal is going to stay open forever. The creature you've been pursuing, I suspect now it may be some kind of Hydra experiment or worse. The bar guest? I thought we had all accepted its mythical origins. Me too. I'm skeptical that the beast just jumped from the pages of ancient lore. No. Doctor Strange, I've killed like probably 200 of these on putting it down regardless of where it came from actually if you could bring it in alive i think there may be a great deal we could learn from it dr strange is no going to waterboard this doctor. dog you it's not waterboarding it's not waterboarding it's an enhanced interrogation it's like a an interrogation card but with a with a crit attached now could you hit somebody with an environmental attack perhaps wolverine you could you could probably you can hit that dog. 38% chance to knock him into the drink. I can't resist, dude. Done waiting. Oh! <laughs> you see how they got swallowed up? Oh, man. It didn't even entertain the thought that they might stick around. They were just like, I'm out of here. And then Blade pushes you off. Ooh! <laughs> that could be a two star. He maybe took a few extra turns, but. What? I got no negative modifiers. It just took me six turns. That's not even that bad. How's your thumb doing? It's actually looking a lot better. Like, it's, it's not looking perfect. It's going to take a while for it to to get back to 100%, but it's definitely, like, it's a lot better. You don't want to know what it looked like on day one if you think that's, like, if you're throwing up with from that, you don't want to know what it looked like on day one. When I heard the crunch of it in the door before I felt the pain of it in the door. Your magic may be powerful, Doctor, but I am still impressed you managed to contain the Bargus. What, what about Blade? He no pushed him over a railing. Your efforts to capture it, Hunter. I believe you really think I won't push you up against the wall? Dude, honestly, this is unironic. You know how they were going to make a 23 Jump Street cross Men in Black movie, but then the studios lost their uh, nerve and the rise of streaming and superhero movies has led to the death of the mid-range comedy that could have like, you know, a $60 million budget, but it, it would have to make at least $200 million at the box office to break even. So instead, studios would rather just make 900 uh, cooking shows. It's uh, Listen, listen, anyway. This is a very roundabout way of saying, what if... The only DLC I would ever buy in Midnight Suns is if they added Michael Scott to the squad. 
I would actually do a, an entirely new playthrough when the DLC dropped if Michael Scott was added to the squad. Or if they just reskinned like the whole game and, and made it so you could replay the campaign but with the cast of The Office. What about a, a, a The Office themed XCOM style game? Todd Packer could show up as like, uh, as Venom. Still minus two? All right, whatever. What am I supposed to do here? Excuse me, my character is not Andrew Tate, okay? He just happens to be bald and have a lot of bad ideas. <laughs> That's where the similarities end. Okay, it's not, it's not, you just, just because you're bald and in good shape and 5'4 does not make you Andrew Tate, okay? So, all we need is a way to disguise the hunter as a demon. I told you before, I am not turning that dog into a cape. And I told you, it is not a dog. Besides, True. I don't think a cape will be enough. You wouldn't dare. My hope is that we can synthesize a facsimile of the bar guest's skin to fool the barrier without harvesting the creature itself. Are you aware of how many of these dogs I have sent to hell over the course of this game? And then all of a sudden they're like, no, don't kill the dog. I have used uh, Captain America's shield to send like 15 of them over the edge of a skyscraper. <laughs> Is not an insignificant Even magic has done it. You telling me magic hasn't set up a limbo portal to send a dog into uh, like a brood mother so that its spine shatters in half? What's with the hoodie? I mean, what is what's with the question? I don't understand the. I don't understand the question. What's with the hoodie? It's just a. It's a shirt. It's January. If you're ever gonna wear a hoodie, like <laughs> it feels like the right time. <laughs> Why so defensive? Why so offensive? They meant Spider-Man? Well, Spider-Man's wearing a hoodie too! I thought your Hawaii shirt looked better. Okay. Okay, the Tim Gunn. I'm not gonna wear the same shirt, you know, five days a week just because you think it looks better than this shirt. <laughs> Every time these guys split, they have like half as much HP. It's like folding a piece of paper seven times. Pretty soon the, the paper's gonna shatter. Or it's gonna become like stronger, strong enough to like block bullets or something. I can never remember. Squeaks, hello. Welcome. Hope you're enjoying Marvel Midnight Suns. It's the only game that's apparently longer than Super Mario 64. Squeaks is in chat. Don't make it weird. I hate when I go to chats. I go to like XQC's chat and I type. XQC, L, my juicer, and then like a hundred thousand people are like, oh, it's my favorite streamer, Northern Lion, and I'm like, hey, this is why I took my badge off in in other streamers' chats. I listen, I'm just I, I'm just a piece of shit like you guys. I'm just here trying to enjoy some entertainment, okay? I'm just like a nobody. I'm just trying to enjoy my day, okay? Not have to type HCJ underscore guys all the time. Oh, I did. Tony! Um, Tony is a recovering alcoholic. We will not have a drink. Let's lounge at the pool together. Is he allowed to get in the water? Or, like, will his heart explode? So I want to give Tony Stark my gift. Holy cow, I got a lot of stuff. Wouldn't Tony Stark, or uh, the return of Captain America, Runaways number one? Tales of Suspense. Iron Man's first explosive appearance. He's gonna go crazy, dude. Loved the legendary gift. Loved the activity. Liked the conversation. And he got some rare board shorts. Dude, we did. We leveled up. Look. Plus 19 friendship XP. That's crazy. That might be the, the single most successful social mission I've ever had in this game. Tony Stark private superlink message. I'm in. Hey, boss. Good hang. There's something you need to see. Clear your schedule. Is this what you wanted to show me? A mushroom? Oh, no. He's microdosing. Fascinating, isn't it? Some of... Oh, I... You're right. Plus one. I mean, dude, he's not getting... 
an extra level of friendship off that. Let's just, just chill out. We're getting close to three, but if three cards are played in a turn, he gets one extra redraw. We also get the world's worst Iron Man costume. Hold on. Let me take a look at that real quick. I mean, Iron Man's like red and orange or red and gold is so iconic. I would be a fool to not ruin it. I mean, this does not go hard. It's only 75 gloss, though. He does poison damage now. What is our next move? I've created a suit of armor from it, tailored to fit you and only you. Oh, baby. In theory, it will allow you to walk among the Lilin. I just hope it fits. It certainly looks impressive, doesn't it? I've decided to call it the Demon Child Suit. A very fitting name, Doctor. On it's pretty levels. horrible, for sure. The mask really We're helps, a lot though. Of eyes in there, Doc. Thought this was a wee scenario going on here. Yes, Tony. I miss the tight leather already. Of course. Particularly with the name. Yeah, well, forgive me if I'm not used to having my combat suits try and take a bite out of me while I calibrate them. It is an impressive, if not pungent, creation. <laughs> Speaking of, I suggest you make use of the suit while okay, the sure, components sure. are still fresh. It's unskippable. That should maximize the protections against that infernal barrier. You know it smell crazy in Understood, there. Understood, Doctor. Yeah, I saw the tweet of the person who the said, here's my stats for 2022. And they wrote that they had sex like 67 times, but they only showered 36 times. I saw the tweet. And then people were like, I bet it smell crazy in there. And they were like, no, it doesn't. I employ an independent consultant fragrance checker to tell me I don't smell every day. Oh, Hunter, what is that hideous thing you're wearing? Hideous? That's harsh, even for you, Sarah. It oh, smells. Maybe it don't what smell crazy in there, for all I know. Made of? I don't know. I've never like met him. I'm just going based on the text. Dog? Pretty much... Terrifies me I didn't dunk on them on Twitter. I do, because then that opens me to criticism. Instead, what I do is I see the tweets that are getting dunked on, and then I talk about them on stream. If a cure for baldness was discovered, would you take it? Well, like, probably the only reason I would take it is to stop being asked this question, like, once every two weeks for the rest of my life. So I'm not sure it's completely worth it, quite frankly. Cost us 33 credits? I, I don't even have the money to train anymore? I, I can't believe I'm too broke to, to spar. Don't we just like walk out? Draw one Iron Man card or draw the last attack played? Draw the last attack played. Ooh. <laughs> Brazilian Iron Man. Dude, he's just a big cheese head. This is Aaron Rodgers. Really know you Compliment again. Oh, thanks. oh he's, dude, he's cheese. so close to <laughs> being the, the next level of friendship, and he's coming out on the mission with us. I need to get enough credits to spar. I need to get enough credits to spar. Credits, credits, nine credits. Okay, just we're keeping a lookout on the ground. Let me know if you. Sorry, we don't have enough money to fight right now, Spider Man. Boxes have credits. I got bad news. I'm out of arcane keys. I haven't been here, though. There must be some good loot over here. What the heck? Somebody's been making some damn witch hazel out here. I can't believe we're 30 hours into the game. My ass is out here scrounging for loose change on the ground. Trying to... <laughs> Literally, like, pouring over the entire map of the game, trying to get 33 bucks so I can spar with... Oh, I can't... Now that I think about it, I can't even spar with Tony. The heck is this? This dude's mining Ethereum in here? Because I, I already sparred with Tony, like, yesterday. Bro, where are your words of power at? I don't know, apparently I missed that side quest. Okay, we're going to save Wanda this time. We're going to take Iron Man with us. We're going to take two nanotech weaves so he can open the fight with an air superiority if necessary, if, if he happens to draw it. Excuse me. 
Combat a empty slot, empty slot. A maximum one of each combat item allowed. I still cannot believe I am letting you go through with this. I cannot believe that smell. Oh, that. Genuine pine. Ran out of new car and vanilla Nella. You're welcome. Are you ready? I thought she was gonna chop his head off. She has been all over me ever since I put this thing on. Oh, she probably yes, smells my dog. Some familiarity between your hound and several of the components we procured to create your suit. Right. Shutting up. Stay there, girl. I Charlie's gonna sacrifice herself this time, guaranteed. Me every time I'm in an elevator. No, they, she, he probably just smells my cats. your mind you know better than to jump in a strange portal how did you get past all that demonic energy right of course demon dog demon energy well the plot wills it you're here. i haven't followed this game away. what is up with the hunter every four story missions we have to skin an animal and uh wear their skin in order to pass through some kind of like uh firewall this is merely the newest iteration i'm literally just like you the suit must be working they cannot see us you can't see me because I've evolved girl. invisibility. I can smell you. Exactly. I believe that machine is the source of our demonic barrier problem. They're literally just napping. Now, I will deactivate it, and you will be incredibly quiet. Agreed? Another Bitcoin miner. Bro, that thing's probably got like a 2080 Ti in it. We could definitely hawk that for some credits so we could spar with Iron Man. Charlie, no! Destroy Bruce Banner's shielding device. Enemy reinforcements will grow stronger every turn. Do not give me that look, Charlie. I've seen you run from your own tail. Where's Iron Man? I was not expecting someone to be in the machine. <laughs> me watching animated movies? Yes, you telling me there's a damn ghost in this shell? Don't worry, they'll move out of the way. I've heard that one before. It does get three kills, though. Feel my call. Feel my what? Oh, shit, we... Dude! Jim Carrey from the number 23! What a late-game twist! Such a brilliant mind. Now so twisted. You have no idea. Oh, right, I forgot about her. She's the Joker now? The others abandoned you, didn't they? Sent you off on a fool's errand and left you to die. I know the feeling. You don't have to answer. What's your collarbone routine? I see it in your mind. We both know Mother will never leave you. You will never have to be alone. Dude, she could like stack Again. books on her clavicle. I'm too strong. They are not alone, Wanda. Neither are you. I know. Oh, 
most powerful mutant of all time? Mm, I think, honestly, just to be safe, let's add two dogs with zero HP. Use Absorb Darkness when Fallen Scarlet Witch is down to draw Lilith's Corruption into the Hunter. Purify Fallen Scarlet Witch three times to permanently end Lilith's influence and restore Wanda Maximoff. I can actually fix her? You're right, I could just use Blast instead of Quick Slash. That's a very good point. I know it's a 0% chance, but like, <laughs> but it looks cool. Imagine if it, if it worked though. Let's do it. He's gonna do it? Oh no. What's the problem? Oh no, he might get hexed. <laughs> don't draw it, don't do it. Thank God. <laughs> Which one of you fuckers said just use uh, the blast if you don't get the quick effect? You're so smart. You're the smartest motherfucker I've ever met. You're too stupid to realize Wanda Maximoff made up her mind 15 minutes ago. You must remember me, Wanda. Wanda. You must remember me, Wanda. So true. So damn true. And then we do still have a move. I mean, I could, I could shove you into the corpse of my dog. But then you'll attack Iron Man instead of magic. Yeah, that would be extremely... She's not wounded anymore. What the hell? Oh, never mind. Couldn't be me. Read the text. Read the text. Then this guy can't even follow the game. He, his voice line was weakened, but then his ass was not actually weakened. It was made vulnerable. Like even the, the enemies can't keep the mechanics straight. You just got knocked the fuck out of the rest. What the hell is the greatest play of all time? He wasn't confused at all. Tony almost said the F word. Yo, we're about to get Scarlet Witch on the squad. Of course you are. It's what you're best at, Ileana. She's so rude. You didn't mean you, that. Wanda. None of us have. None of us ever will. Save your lies for Attica. Attica! Attica! Me when I tell my wife that I just had a 570 kilojoule ride on the peloton. I think she's fine, honestly. I actually think she's safe. I know it seemed... Listen, they wouldn't give us yet another mission where we won and then lost in the cinematic. I refuse. I refuse to believe it. I bet, like, yeah, this, we're gonna have another cutscene where, like, Wanda's, like, almost gonna break into the Abbey or something like that, but then actually the caretaker and Agatha are gonna use magic to free her from her demonic chains and then she's going to be on our side. I told you in so many ways such as Yes. 
All right, I Wanda. Knew you do it. Let's go fishing. Welcome home. They don't know I'm a ghost. Talk to Wanda. We got our number one witch back. <laughs> Whoa, dude, there's like seven witches on the team. It's just like they're right here. Rude. I mean, Magic was on the mission that captured her. There's no need to be. But what if I hurt you? Oh, come on. You can't hurt me. But we were. Bad. He might kill you. He's not killing me. What? He said that. Whatever, who cares? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, enough with the third degree. I know what we should do. Celebrate. Celebrate what? Your return, duh. I'm sorry, Nico, but I'm tired. I should probably get some sleep. Too tired to watch <sighs> it's the been room? A long time since I've slept. Yes, you should rest. We will talk in the morning. Love you, Wanda. Love you too. Excuse me here, Tony. Holy cats, we did. <laughs> Do you Sorry. Uh, I hope you. Uh, everyone contributed to this. I just got a friendship level with him. We don't have to farm social points right now. Magic, on the other hand, we got to farm social points. It's our traumas that make us strong. Okay, kind of a problematic attitude, but like, look. She uh, she liked it. I'll take that. How about you, Nico? Um, now you outnumber the Avengers. She's gonna like that. That's a gimme. Thanks for the social points and the dark balance. Hello, Doctor Strange. Um, at least uh, your regret is valid. He likes to he likes to have his ego sated like that. So I, I I couldn't farm dark balance points. We can definitely farm dark balance points here. Never doubt me again. <laughs> this could have been avoided if you just trusted me. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Seen it all. This is really something. Bro, it's literally just a blind box. It's not that big of a deal. Oh my god. And now Lilith's gonna be like, what the fuck? Your mom, when she asks you to do something and you tell her you're gonna do it because you don't want to say no to your mom, but you know you're not gonna do it. And then, like, two weeks later, when she's like, hey, did you do that thing? And you're like, no, I didn't do it. And she's I like, did not think Ryan! You did it, child. Okay, hold on. Private Superlink message, of course, from Tony Stark. Let's chat in the library again. He's obsessed uh, with me, dude. I'm not looking for your deep, dark diary secrets. Don't get freaked out. I don't care who you have a crush on. Okay. I want to know more secrets about magic. Tony, just do go to Star City Games, buy the most the highest win rate legacy deck. You got the money for it. Just start trotting out, you know, the power 9 every single match. I'll keep the secret to my grave. Of course. Oh. Iron Patriot? Is this somehow even worse? Ooh, spend redraws to reduce heroism cost. Mmm, yummy, yummy, yummy. Hey, Anel, I feel like you're the cousin that always wins in board games at family gatherings. I would say that that is not correct. Uh, and it's, it's not that I'm, like, horrendous at board games or anything like that. It's just I... About ten minutes into board games, I don't really care if I win or lose. All I care about is that people are having fun, including myself. Like, if my options in a board game are like, I could take a turn in 30 seconds and then pass to the other person so they could have fun, or take five minutes to concoct the perfect turn where, like, I win with one extra, like, I, I get exactly perfect lethal, I take my turn in 30 seconds and then pass to the next person, because I'm, I'm just all about having fun. Hold on, you got any books in here? You've seen him. Was anybody else here wear a golden you know, collar that it. says, in a shirt that says, I'm going to make you my witch? Oh, it's you. I'm not going to tell a woman I just met that she apologizes too much. Where, where do I get the nerve, man? No need to. Okay. 
Is it weird? I think she's going to be waiting in my dreams. Join the club. Let's just farm some free social offer. I don't, I don't want her to... Hey, we need to get her to friendship level two. You did? So that we can actually get some advantages. Holy cow. I should go. <laughs> she said, sorry for talking your ear off. And I was like, it's okay. Okay, hold on. Quick compliment for you. I can sense your inner strength just by being near you. What the hell? Yes. You're so weird. Oh, by the way, I should go. Hey, boss, head to the forge. There's something you need to see. Maybe we won't it's do another mission today. <laughs> oh, I will let you know they just happens. keep Here, piling it on, man. A real Santa's elf vibe. But that's not relevant. Come to the forge, okay? Hello, I'm here. The... Yes, okay, okay, fine. I... I, you didn't say anything about Wanda. I don't care if Doctor Strange is mad at me. Trust your instincts. I don't care if he's too mad at me. Let's I'm put it that sure way. To... Talk to Tony. You're... Hello, Tony. Uh... If we don't get the parchment, we'll be the barbecue. You're... Tony loves jokes. If you're going to do something, do it quickly. Wait, did he just say we're halfway there? All we need now is the parchment of power. This must be an imposter, Tony, because the real Tony absolutely 100% would have said living on a prayer afterwards. This is going to hurt. It's not a lot of KOs, unfortunately, but it is a lot of damage. It's not a war crime. It's like saying cutting your lawn is a war crime. How could it be a war crime? They're literally just like, they're demons. OMG, it is. No, OMG, it isn't. It isn't. Cluster bombs are a war crime? Yeah, if you use them on people. These are not people. Look at this. What, what even is this? Stop dehumanizing them. Look at them! They're not human! They just have boobies! Let's generate some heroism. Then. Oh, you know what? Maybe with the heroism... Is it possible I could drop this on you? Ooh! Good for you. Is that a war crime too? I know they're soulbound, but they're gonna come back with like 60 HP each next time. That's quick fodder. Oh, dropping a light post on a on a demon is a war crime. What did you even do? I resisted, you did nothing. He's okay. <laughs> Holy fuck. He is not okay. These, these dogs do like the most damage. The soul bounds like don't hit each other. So yeah, okay, mind bend the dog. Is it a war crime to break the mind of your enemy and have them viciously bite on their friend on their haunches? It is. Okay, sure it is. Makes me sick. People are so weak these days. Is it a war crime to use adamantium claws embedded in my metatarsals to eviscerate an enemy? Oh, it is. Okay, sure, whatever you say. Who's getting attacked the most? Iron Man's definitely taking some heat this turn. Behold the light skip. That should help. Is it a war crime to heal somebody now? Are you healing a war criminal? You were too weak. Excuse me, the Hippocratic Oath takes precedent over the Geneva Convention, probably. I don't know that for certain, but it seems like that's sensible. Okay, Wolverine, I forgot that this taunted like a bunch of enemies, so you gotta push this dog off the edge, brother. It's your only, it's just your only shot. If I ever don't laugh when that happens, then like I've been replaced with another person. Like all the other enemies, they have like a teeter animation. The dogs just either are unaffected or just fall to their death immediately. Big one. My 
heroism's increased. A pathetic attempt at intimidation. <laughs> Why does Iron Man sound like um, when like a, a a smart kid gets bullied? Give you my lunch money, huh? <laughs> pathetic attempt at intimidation. All right, here it is, though. Never, nevertheless. I would rather suffer the pain of hunger than get an atomic wedgie. So here you go, Dwayne. He's got one, 185. Tempted to just use two heroism here. Drop this. Yeah, okay, drop it on you. I got plays. Split, but don't run. Stay right there. War crime, war crime. You listen to yourself. Oh, so every time I do a war crime, you're going to say war crime? We're going to be here for a while then. Hey, but we're one star on Heroic 3. Heroic 2? Heroic 2, maybe? That's the equivalent of three stars, because you get one star per extra level of heroicness. Ooh, now that Wanda's back, I feel like the band is finally back together. Can't wait to get some one-on-one -on -one time with her. Miss that witch. Go easy on her, Robbie. She's been through a lot. What? It might be a while before things go back to normal again. <laughs> normal? Since when were we ever normal? But Nico is right. Wanda might not be as social as we would like her to be. But I have a copy of Avengers number four for her. I just want to make sure she knows that we love her and are happy to have her home. Maybe start slow with something familiar, like a movie night. Blade, you just read my mind. Wow, really? What am I thinking now? He's you like must Joey Tribbiani. For it to be read, Robbie. Yo! Party in Wanda's honor. I think she. She really ate him up, dude. That reminds me, one time I was camping with my cousins. This is when we were like 11, 12 years old. They were brushing their teeth in this morning, or in this morning? They were brushing their teeth in the morning, and one of my cousins said, uh, look, my teeth are squeaky clean, and then she did the thing where she rubbed her finger on her teeth, so they went like, ur, 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 ur. and then my other cousin, the youngest cousin said, hey, look, my teeth are empty clean, and it made no noise. And then the same walk. cousin replied, just like your head. <laughs> oh, man. May I join you? I can, I can. Private Superlink message from Robert Reyes. Hello, Hunter. It was good to hang. How many private messages? Holy cow. Do you see how many private messages I got here, dude? Okay. I could do shop class. Okay. Yes, I'm ready. Stop by at night when we're all free. I will find you tonight. What is this? Is a, this is an ancient message. This is from like years ago. Magic's birthday party is tonight? Read the book. I'm ready to attend book club. Okay, I have time. See you there now. Thanks for coming out to meet me. You're welcome. Why are you being so nice to me? I respect your power. She loves it. Better to be feared than loved. She's like, um, I suggested seven other principles. No, <laughs> Daryl. Hey, compliment values increased too. Finally, I said absolute power corrupts absolutely the axiom I knew she wanted me to say anyway. And she said, if that's what you believe, I could not have. This I can't even do any research, man! You just can't win, can you? 18 months of playing SAP, 10 hours a week. Tell me he's pivoting to SAP. I, I used to hate it, but I'm addicted. And WTF not wanting to play the new pack? I, play <laughs> See, I got bullied for playing so much SAP. Now I'm getting bullied for not playing SAP. But here's the kicker. I'm playing SAP! There's videos on YouTube every day. There's a video of the Golden Pack from today. Yeah, but, but, oh, like you're doing right now? It is so messed up that multiple people have different opinions. Very easy movie to movie today, too. Okay, you know what? Let's go check it out. Let's... Whew.
<laughs> we're not wrong. Um, listen, I, I'm, I'm not going to set like a new record for uh, links. Like I might, I might take a little, it, it might take a few extra steps. However, I mean, one of the terminal points is Zoolander. So you definitely just go like, I'm just seeing who, uh, who else is in Schindler's list here. You're either going Rafe Fiennes or Liam Neeson, in my opinion, but you could go Ben Kingsley. You got to go Liam Neeson. Liam Neeson's been in some comedies, okay? And then we're going to scroll it down a little bit. Lots of people are in Zoolander. So let's take your time. Um, is Mel Gibson in Zoolander? No, but he might be. No, wait, hold on. Will Ferrell is obviously in Zoolander. He plays Mugatu. That's a total distance of two. That's an easy one. But the other thing is, everybody's in uh, Zoolander. <laughs> I, I did not know that Liam Neeson was in Daddy's Home 2. I got to check that one out. I have seen Daddy's Home 1 on an airplane. Is that the one where Will Ferrell is a stepdad? Yes, Will Ferrell plays a stepdad. Um, and he gets... He feels emasculated because the father of his child is like a, a badass biker guy. So he tries to become a badass, but then he finds out that his wife is like, what are you doing, idiot? I love you because you're like a good guy. Mark Wahlberg was like a horrible father. Also, I'm Linda Cardellini. Atriaca Senior Movie to Movie Progress via Library of Letourneau videos. That's funny. Yeah, we know that Mark Wahlberg is like not like he's done bad things in his life, but he's also done very like bad things semi recently, like suggesting in an interview with Men's Health that if he was on the airplane, 9 11 wouldn't have happened. We don't need to dredge up ancient history. We'll just like, you know, bring up some history from fairly recently instead and see that, you know, he's probably had a little bit of character growth, but also not, not enough in my opinion. He's also made horrible movies. What are you talking about? He is a pretty good filmography. He's in The Departed. Okay, Ted 2 and also Ted 1. I would probably, <laughs> I, would, I would agree with you on that one. He's in Boogie Nights. Transformers? Listen, but we're not going to throw everybody under the bus for Transformers. John Malkovich is in Transformers. John Turturro is in Transformers. That doesn't mean Barton Fink doesn't exist. Like, that's... Listen, if Michael Bay came to you and said, all you got to do is read, like, two lines, and all the lines are, like, you know, they're transforming. Like, then here's a $5 million. You would do it, too. You would go in. Yes, you would. So is the internet just broken today? Is that what's happening? Nintendo Switch online services are down. I'm going to try to reboot the game. We have a viewer lobby going right now. Maybe, maybe there's an update or something I missed. Please remove the bunker life icon. I don't know what kind of lives you lead. That is so far on the bottom of my to-do list. Performing like God, the landscaping duties on my Nintendo Switch home screen that I never even see. Performing a five second action is beneath him. Well, yeah, why don't you just take a five second action and shut your mouth for five seconds? You know, just because something doesn't take a lot of time doesn't mean that it's worth doing. There's lots of shit you could be doing that takes no time. Some of you probably have fingernails that are like three inches long right now. Half the people in chat right now are like, I'm hungry. Oh, do you have food in your house? Yeah. Why don't you eat it? I don't want that food. I thought you were hungry. Well, 
Okay, you want to go to the grocery store? I'm not that motivated to do it instead. And you want me to go, uh, to, to snip, snip, snip. I haven't played Mario Party 8 in three weeks. Let's remove the icon from my home screen. I only play like one game a year on Switch anyway. Chip, don't gaslight me. I don't hate people with depression. It's just people will tell me like, they're like, hey, fix your life. And I'm like, you fix your life. And they're like, I can't, I have depression. And I'm like, well, then stay in your lane. <laughs> Keep your comments to yourself, okay? All I said was uninstall Bunker Life. It's not about you anymore. It's about the person I made up in my head, okay? Great hole. You know what I was thinking? I, look, I didn't make this up. If any, Obviously, it's from Whiplash. What the hell? Everyone got a birdie? I thought nobody got a birdie except me. Um... But not my tempo is like the, it's a perfect expression for not liking something. Because in the movie Whiplash, fucking Miles Teller is like, he's pretty much on his tempo. Even J.K. Simmons can't figure out what he's like, not my tempo, too slow. I don't know, maybe a little too fast, it didn't just feel right. If you ever need to say that you don't like something, and people are like, why? What reason do you have? And you don't have a good reason? Just say, not my tempo. I'm okay. Yeah, like it's not quite my tempo. I don't, I, I can't really explain what the, what the reason is. Well, that was pretty bad actually. Do you IRL golf? I would if any courses were free and carbon neutral and close to me. I want to golf, but it's inconvenient for me. So I'm simply pretending that it is me making a stand for the environment. Fuck all golfers, okay? First off, you're ruining the earth with your golf courses. Secondly, you're creating so much demand in the market that the shit is so expensive that I don't feel like it's worth it for me to get involved. So if you could just back off for a little bit so they eased off on the pricing pressure. Why would I care about where my recycling goes? It doesn't even help. Yeah, but like, why are you such a baby that you're like, oh, I'm not going to rinse out my takeout container. I'm just going to throw it in the trash. You see, you know, you don't have any other shit going on. Just do it. If it helps out a little bit, it hurts like zero. It's not wasted water. We have water treatment plants. It's like 99.999% recycled. Probably. I don't know. As mouth. Oh, other countries exist that pollute more, so I'm just going to throw my aluminum cans in the garbage can instead of a bin that's like two centimeters away from it. You listen to yours, what are you doing with the extra none time that you're saving every day? You don't have to recycle, but like, you know, just be like, I'm lazy. Don't, don't try to like spin it into some kind of like morally superior take that like, oh, there's people are burning coal in Calcutta right now, so I'm just gonna throw all my Budweiser cans in the trash can instead. Like, just relax. Just be like, I'm lazy. There's, there's some baseness in laziness. Because as soon as you say, no, I'm lazy, then it becomes self-care instead of delusion. Plus, like, you should, I mean, tin cans are a different story because most people probably do this, but you should just take them to the recycling depot if you're, you know, if you need a reason. You get 10, 10 cents a can! It's not as betwixt as I'd like. This shit is pretty much right behind the tree. <laughs> oh, or is it as betwixt as I'd like? It's probably gonna spoon into the second tree, but it might not. It might not. Don't. That's where I wanna be. <laughs> it went into the canopy, man. Seven iron probably clears this, though. Yeah, for sure. With none backspin.
It's unfortunate. It's poorly played. This is for par. I really thought it was going to dunk into the hole. I can't even see what direction it's lilting, dude. It, 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 honestly, this is a chip. It's just an easier chip. I'm gonna time out. <laughs> Let me in, I'm gonna time out! Double bogey. Well, that was like the worst played hole of all time. It doesn't matter. It matters for ranking points. It's not just about winning. I don't care about the casino. Again, I'm the roulette wheel. You should care about the casino. Wow, both me and the previous leader just freaking choked it. Mm -mm. Me and who? Would you rather have a good chip or good drip? I would rather have a good chip. Would you rather have a good butt or a good putt? Um, I would rather have a good butt, I think. It would be nice to have a good putt, though. Once again, the picture is not me. But I wish it was me. The picture you... Somebody even posted on the subreddit. They said the, the title was like NL Baby Girl or something like that. I don't even know what the hell that even means. And then it was, hey, has everyone seen the photo of NL with the huge ass? What happened? It's gen... Just like the Road Rage video is not me. And just like the Road Rage video, I wish it was me. My new driving pet peeve is we have a lot of cyclists in Vancouver. This is not anti-cyclist, it's anti-driver. Just hold, you hold the dogs off for a second. I come to an intersection. At the intersection, I have to turn right, okay? I don't put myself right next to the sidewalk. The reason I don't put myself right next to the sidewalk is that there's frequent cyclists that are coming through on the right side between me and the sidewalk. So I put, I put myself, you know, like halfway over and throw my indicator on. And then the car behind me, like it gets so mad. Like it puts itself like right up against me, but like offset completely like overrunning the sidewalk and they're honking their horn and stuff like that. And I'm like, there's cy cyclists coming, you psychopath. Just relax. They're not accommodating the cyclists, man. We're all out here together, okay? Can we just like just make the drive as smooth as possible for everybody, including alternative sources of transportation? We always want backspin, otherwise we get a huge bounce here. So we want like a 3.8 backspin. Nice we take those. Oh, we take those. I'm a little upset by the, the backspin, but okay. I thought that was that was really good. It at least gave us a chance. A chance. That's what I call a sack lunch. Way too much left. Apologize. Apologize to me. I'm sorry. Okay. Apology accepted.
Somebody did albatross. I mean, what can you say? You have to say respect. Hey, Anel, are you going to play Spelunky anytime soon? Don't, no plans. Presently, no plans to. I can't, I can't. Your name is Lord of Spelunky, though? No, my name is Ryan. Your name is Lord Maple Bacon. Why aren't you on Reddit right now? Sorry, it wasn't even them who said that. I just saw the name and I saw an opportunity to do some Jeet Kune Do and use my enemy's uh, power against them. You're right, it is 1.30 on a Tuesday. I shouldn't be mad that I'm losing because we're playing against like sick teenagers. And the truly scariest demographic to play against in competitive multiplayer games, which is unemployed people in their early to mid 20s. I just, there's just no shot, like, you want a guaranteed loss? Go up against, like, somebody who graduated from university last year in League of Legends. It's just, it's over. It's done. There's no chance. That's not a knock on League of Legends. I know some people have been very sensitive about that lately. Wait until you play against a high school kid who's got nothing to do. Now, this is not a knock on my, I, I don't know if he's, like, a second cousin twice removed or something like that. But he, he was a heavy League of Legends user. We were talking to him at Christmas. He kind of got off the sauce, which I, I was very happy for him. Anyway, he got off the sauce, or he was talking. He was like, I don't think I really want to play anymore. I've got other ambitions now. Next day, we got back home. Kate signed on to the Summoner's Rift. Would you believe it? Guess who was online? You don't need to guess. Mm. It was him. Who was it? <laughs> Media literacy. Set an all-time low. Not, not the best part. You said relapse is part of recovery? Yeah, but like, you gotta at least try. I mean, it had been one day. <laughs> If he took like two days off and then like relapsed a couple times, then I'd be like, you know, the poor guy's trying. But he was like, next, he, th that night he was like, I don't want to play this game anymore. In the morning, he's like, I'm bored. I'm all in. He was probably Jones in at Christmas. You're not wrong. <laughs> as soon as I mentioned League, he's like, I don't like it that much. He wasn't like, he was a really nice guy, honestly. My niece was vegan for two weeks until she came to Christmas and there were cookies available. Hey, they, those could have been made with nut milk. Love some Destroyer. Kaput is an amazing album. Dude, we must have deranked. We're back here with VIP Daniel. <laughs> oof, oof, oof. Toxic, toxic. Meanwhile, everybody in chat is like, oh, I know you're talking about something completely unrelated right now, but see you at B rank. Wow, you're like insanely bad at this game. By the way, are you ever going to play Dave the Diver again? Huge fan. Then you're like, hey, don't say rude stuff. And they're like, oh my God, I am so sorry. I have been watching you for 12 years. I don't know what happened to me. I'm 31 years old. I just got swept up into the moment. Everybody else was being toxic and not being punished for it. How dare you punish merely me for being to... Save us both the trouble, okay? I just got a suspicion this one's going in. After all that practice. Well, uh, this one is just, it's toasted. It's toasted from the get-go. What if we landed in the hole? Maybe they, that'll count as like a three-pointer? Like a three-piece with backspin? The rare golf three-pointer? Nope. Stroke six. Great. What is that physically even possible? 
Can somebody draw me a diagram of how forces were applied to do that? It doesn't see. Was there like a? Was there antimatter in the hole? Antimatter in the hole. I can't. We've officially reached a level where Elo is too good to drop down, but not good enough to win. Have you reached a level where you're like entertained by the product that you're watching on the screen, or do you just like you're so cookie cook, cookie clicker pilled? That all you want to see is number go up. When number goes up, it hits the great parts of my brain. When number goes down, I get depressed again. The, the realities of the world come back and the hounds of hell beseech me. The latter, you got to train that muscle. You got to watch some shit you hate now and then. Make you appreciate the stuff you like. I want to, you're lucky I'm not auditing you. Because I remember like two weeks ago, there was a guy who like, I lost two games in a row. And he said, here we go. This is the end of golf. And then he just kept typing it. Like every single time there was like a bad shot for the next two weeks. And golf is still here. So I think now he's trying to like, he's like, I'm not wrong. I was just early. I'm, I'm like the Peter Schiff of the, of the believer economy. Will we ever see Shambara come back? You will never see Shambara come back. I told you, new, new, new Year's resolution. People ask me to do things I don't want to do. For the last 10 years, I'd say, mm, maybe. And then the reward was they would ask me again. And then when I said, maybe not, they would be like, you promised. The lobbies I'm in right now, if, if you get a par, everybody cyber bullies you and tells you to stop playing it. Par in the dictionary says competent. That's the first description of the word. Exactly good enough. Only we've reached a level in Switch Sports Golf where it's not good enough. It's not good enough anymore. It's like the word mid. No, because mid is bad. You guys watch Pressure Cooker on Netflix yet? There's a 30-year-old man on the show who keeps saying that's fire and it's driving me crazy. I guess, like, if you're 30, you might be more Gen Z than Millennial. I'm not totally sure. But, like, I'm like, dude, you're old. Leave, leave the fire parlance to the kids these days. I'm not saying kids shouldn't say it, but his ass is not a kid. He keeps going, ooh, that gazpacho's fire. Ooh, that crudo's fire, bro. Can I still call my friends bro at 30? Yeah. Like, whatever you called your friends when you were, like, 22, that's what you're going to call them for the rest of your life. You're going to be, like, 80 years old and go in, like, Bro, really? Bro, fish and chips night. Bro, it's fish and chips day at the old folks' home. Like, you see 80-year-olds, they're calling each other, like, deer and stuff like that. You think it's because old people say that. No, they just had, they said that when they were younger. Now they're old. So they keep saying the same stuff that they anchored to when they were like young adults. <clears throat> it's like people were not, they didn't turn 80 and they're like, guess what? Your name's like Bertha now. Your name is B. Your name is Rose, you know? They were like, they, they were born like that in like the 1920s or whatever. Like when they were doing roll call for kindergarten in 1951, they were like, is Agnes here? And then like seven kids put up their hand. And they're like, no, Agnes C. Agnes C A. Obadiah. Ezekiel. Hosea. Noah. Paul, 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 Paul. Buster. Hap. Is there a Hap Diggly? Noah's getting popular again. I did. I, I heard some news on baby names because I listened to baby news radio with my daughter. Apparently, Noah is the most popular boy's name the past couple of years. Most popular girl's name worldwide, Olivia. Makes sense to me. Oh, that was for the win. <laughs> Why does it make sense to me? Because whenever I meet like parents of kids my own age, they're always like, this is my daughter, Olivia. Parents of kids your own age, you know what I meant. Oh, we were never catching up to a meal anyway. I'll, I'll happily take my second. Cool. I'm so default. Chibli, what's your full name? 
<laughs> Chib, Chib underscore Lee. Well, pretty, you know, we recovered a lot of the points we lost. Bugle Sophia Bog drop. What is that? Like a, is it New Zealand humor? Is that like a character from Wellington Paranormal? Will we ever reach S rank? This is why people are so bad at investing. It's been two days. They're like, I'm not retired yet. Just, you know, believe in the long term or don't bet any points anymore. I'm sick of hearing about all all through 2022. Every investing subreddit, this it, it sucks, dude. I freaking hate this. It's never. It's been, it's been four days. It's been it's been a month. Let's chill out, okay? We're gonna get there, just inch by inch. Have some belief. Buy some. You know, put put your money in some money market funds. We're gonna be okay. Just like we're gonna finish. Um, Midnight Suns, like we're, we keep knocking it out every day. I was thinking about that. People in 2021 were like 5% gains monthly, um, not interested. I mean, we, I don't know how much you guys want to talk about bonds, but even the, the Bogleheads Forum in 2021, people were like, why would I ever buy bonds? All it takes is one bad year, Joker face. Now the same posts are like, why would I ever buy anything but bonds? You'd have to be stupid to ever buy a stock in your whole life. 1988, something, something with a 7.2. I'm looking for high scores first to show me what to pay attention to. We got a really bad movie from 2008. We got a really bad movie from 2020, a pretty bad movie from 2018 too. A uh, blank, blank. Holmes and Watson. Is Holmes and Watson on here? Is this Will Ferrell? Holmes and Watson. Drama, action, action. Musical drama from 2007. That got a 7.6. I should know this. Music drama? Is it called La 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 La? Drama, romance. Comedy, comedy. This one should be easy too. It's got so many exclamation marks. Blank and blank, blank, blank. Family fantasy comedy adventure. A science fiction movie, a science fiction crime movie from 2001. Blank and blank, 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 1999. A lot of action. Some This is a very versatile actor. A lot of comedy. A comedy from 2021. A lot of comedy. Family Adventure. <laughs> so I can just keep repeating it. I'm going to throw one out here. I'm going to throw out Mark Wahlberg. I don't think it's Mark Wahlberg. But I thought, you know, he's done a lot of action. He's done a lot of comedy. He was top of mind. Don't see it, okay? I have no other guesses. Are they older than Jackie Chan? They are older than Jackie Chan and doing comedies. You're going to think this is crazy. Is it possible this is John Lithgow? He's been in hyphenated movies like Planet of the Apes, The Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. He's been in uh, This is 40. John, John Lithgow? John, John Lithgow, thank you. They are younger than John Lithgow and have never heard of him, okay? They're between 51 and 77. This is a gimme. You go Liam Neeson. Wrong. They are younger. They are older than Liam Neeson, but younger than John Lithgow. So this is a septuagenarian. This is impossible. <laughs> They're 70? 70 years old. Sylvester Stallone. Arnold. Okay, they're between 70 and 75. John Goodman is actually a great guess. John Goodman. It's not John Goodman. And also, none of these people have ever been in movies with any of them. Bill Murray's another great guess. I'm just farming from chat right now. They're between 72 and 75, and they've never been in a movie with Mark Wahlberg, John Lithgow, Liam Neeson, Sylvester, Arnold, John Goodman, or Bill Murray.
They're 72 to 75. Parse some titles? What are you doing? Like, unless there's X-Men in there, I'm screwed. Hello. I don't know if I heard you right, but I feel like you might have dissed uh, League of Legends. I didn't. I dissed uh, your cousin for saying he said he was going to quit League of Legends. And then as soon as we got home, he was on Summoner's Rift. Oh, I see. <clears throat> well, because I'm, I'm streaming League of Legends. Oh. Do you know today is the day that they opened the 2023 season? I did not know that. Well, that's why. Did you know that up until yesterday, the Buffalo Sabres had never scored less than six goals when they were wearing their reverse retro jerseys? What the heck? Why would I know that? <laughs> why would I know that? I don't know. That? Just, just spitballing. Who knows that in the chat? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you made mandu. It's my last dose. I'm sad. I'm all out now. My my last last bit of food. But mandu, I gotta say, it's the best meal prep a human can ever think of. It's pretty good. I just can't fold the dumplings. So it was Gerard Depardieu. Listen, I know this man's name. I'm sure I've seen a movie with him in it. I know he's a famous French actor, but there's like no shot. Let me see. Have I seen any of these? I, I've seen like a third of the life of Pi. I have not seen Babylon AD. I have seen Paris Je t'aime. Okay, but like that's an ensemble film. That's an ensemble film. That's not... That's a movie that consists of like 13 short films. It's not like he's carrying the cast, okay? Listen, I did see 102 Dalmatians, but that was like a long time ago. Like I was probably sitting on the gymnasium floor. What the heck is ra? Ra. Isn't that what people reply to when you post a thirst trap on Twitter? Hey, out shopping today. See you guys on stream later. Woof, woof. Burger. Down, boy. Bark for you? Why don't you fucking bark for me, huh, pussy? Bark for me right fucking now. Rah. Rah. Woof, woof. Burger. Down, boy. Woof. Oh, sorry, that's Apollo's stream title. <laughs> he got that dog in him. Guess the game? I'm not doing Wordle, okay? I have no respect for Wordle. I will try to guess the game. Wordle is for people who go to city council meetings, and that's just not me. This is um, like a PlayStation 2 game. You know what? This is a Siphon Filter. Siph this is Siphon Filter 2. Wrong. Metacritic score is 98. That's pretty good. This is beyond good and evil. Original platform PS3, Xbox 360. This is uh, GTA 5. Grand Theft Auto 5. Action Adventure Open World. This is Grand Theft Auto 4. It's a gimme. I'm a little surprised it's not Siphon Filter uh, 2, though. Can I see yesterday's? Replay previous day. Unplayed. This shit is like a damn... Uh, this is Skyrim. This is that Ubisoft game that's called From Dust. Wrong. This is Skyrim. <laughs> this is Dishonored. This is Resident Evil 4. This is... um. <laughs> I know you. Alan Wake? Alan Wake 1? He's crazy. I'm crazy. Replay previous days here. How about day 30, 239? This is Control. 
Metacritic score 84. It's Far Cry 4. Far Cry 5. PC, PS4, Xbox One. This is Dying Light. Genre, RPG. It's Final Fantasy 13 2. It's Fallout 4. That's a gimme. <laughs> He's washed. You've played that? That's true. I didn't just play it, I beat it. What's this one? It's Deadly Premonition. Metacritic score of 84. So a bad game. Um, it's Tokyo Jungle. PC, PS4. This is DMC. This is Devil May Cry. Four. This is The Division. This is The Division 2. He's crazy. I'm insane at this game, honestly. I will never miss a day. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I will send you over to Kate. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon, and I'll see you tomorrow. From Tokyo Jungle to The Division 2. Yeah, I apologize, because The Division 2 might be a bad game, but Tokyo Jungle isn't. There's some art, some art in Tokyo Jungle. Either way, I'll see you tomorrow. See ya. Because he was moral, they called him insane. Delusions of grandeur, visions of splendor. This manic depressing, he walks in the rain. Eyes wide open. Get out of my head, Getty Lee.